And that was Harry Civic. That's done for you. Good morning, George. Emmanuel. 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 God with us. We thank God. My name is Engineer Olawale Anthony. I'm an electrical engineer. On the faithful day, I went to the site to work, one of my sites. As I was working on the armor cable, unfortunately, one of the armor now shook my hand. Or just like ordinary other day, I press it, I gave it force aid. The second day, I gave it force aid. The third day, I discovered that the hand was swelling up. I said, ah, what is happening? I got treated. The third day, the fourth day, and I ran to the synagogue church of nation, where my elves come from. Fortunately, on that very day, our mother in the Lord, Pastor Evelyn T.B. Joshua, prayed for me severely. Immediately, the pain I was having in this hand disappeared. Before then, as an engineer, I couldn't use this hand to raise anything. Even to eat, it becomes very difficult with this hand. Somebody has to feed me. But unfortunately, immediately, the woman of God, Mama Evelyn T.B. Joshua, prayed for me and touched this hand with the hand from heaven. The pains and all the pains disappeared. I got myself, I could move the hand, and the hand, before three days, dried up. Let us put those hands wonderfully for our Savior Jesus Christ. And this is the hand, the very hand. I cannot use the hand for all other activities for my work as an engineer. I can use it for other things to eat and do other things at home. I thank God of Senator President Joshua who has done the great thing in my life and the life of my belief. This is what this is how it was the very, the very day it started. The second day, or the third day, I saw that it was growing up. I said, ah, after treatment, it was swelling up. It could become bigger. I said, ah, what is happening? Fortunately, on the this, on this Sunday, we on the 9th of June, when I brought it to emergency for the prayer line, before so, the woman of God prayed for it and intervened. And the Holy Spirit intervened. So that was how the hand was yes. looking before you were prayed for by Pastor Evelyn Joshua. Yes. And can you show us that same hand now? Let us see it. This is the very hand. Can you see? Are you feeling any pain as you're moving? No more it? pain. No more pain. No more pain. No more pain. Let's put our hands once for Father and Savior Jesus Christ. So with the wonderful thing God has done in your life, what is your word of advice to people who are listening to you? My word of advice for everybody listening to me is to trust in God and run to God all the time because he's our maker and the one that has the power to heal and bless. Even Escuchamos el increíble testimonio de este hombre que vino a la sinagoga iglesia de todas las naciones con un problema en su piel. Él vino aquí con una enfermedad severa, había buscado solución en diferentes lugares, pero no encontraba hasta que llegó aquí a la sinagoga iglesia de todas las naciones, donde recibió oración. Y gracias a Dios, él recibió su milagro para la gloria de Dios. Está aquí testificando en el poderoso nombre de Jesús. 
Et on entend l'extraordinaire témoignage de l'ingénieur Anthony Olawale. Il dit que voilà, il s'était blessé à la main et sa main était vraiment enflée. Il n'arrivait plus à utiliser sa main ni pour travailler, même pour manger. C'était très difficile. Il dit qu'il avait une plaie au niveau de son doigt. Il y avait même du pu à l'intérieur. Ceci était très douloureux. C'est là qu'il est venu ici à la synagogue église de toutes les nations où la pasteur Elvin Joshua a prié pour lui au nom de Jésus-Christ. Il dit qu'immédiatement, la plaie a commencé à guérir, à s'assécher. Il rend toute la gloire. Aujourd'hui, sa main est guérie. Il est complètement guéri. Dites à tous, faites confiance à Dieu, quel que soit votre situation. Non, non.